up everybody this is Kev the Sure Shot here with a little quick uh, tip video uh, right now I'm working with my iPad and I have it connected with my Nectar uh, MIDI controller so basically anything that I'm playing on the iPad right now I got Core Gadget up I'm able to control via MIDI with my keyboard here uh, one tip that I wanted to share because I, I had a hard time finding it myself specifically with this keyboard is how to change the MIDI channels and what you want to do, or the reason you would want to change your MIDI channels, especially when working with a, an app like Core Gadget, is it allows you to pull up different instruments. And you want to be able to control them one by one, but there isn't a, a way of just simply just choosing, you know, say for instance, this drum machine. I just choose it and then I'm playing just the drum machine. So what you have to do is you have to assign them MIDI channels. With General MIDI, you have up to 16 channels. Um, and the way you do that, first on the uh, core gadget side of things, is you will uh, you want to hit your function and you want to hit this little up arrow. So I'll bring up your your controls here, and down here on this button here, you'll see the MIDI input. You'll want to change that to whatever your MIDI controller is. For me, it's the impact, and then you want to assign it to a MIDI channel. We're gonna do channel one for this one, and just kind of so on and so forth. So here second drum machine will be oops, be channel 2 next one is channel 3 and last one is channel 4 alright so now how do you change your MIDI channels on your keyboard so that you can control so right now um, I have it set to channel 1 but I'll show you how to get there so what you want to do is here on your left hand side you want to hold the octave up and octave down buttons together and you'll see on your screen it'll flash you have a few options to control with these buttons so you hit the octave up and octave down and then hit down you'll be able to kind of shuffle through so there you have program and if you go one more you'll be able to control your octaves so right now we're just in octaves so if we hit the, the two buttons and go up to GCH GCH stands for global channel or global MIDI channel and then if we cycle back and forth between the buttons you'll see it goes from 1 all the way up to 16 so we'll go to 1 and you'll see it corresponds with that particular drum machine that we have programmed to channel 1 all right we go to channel 2 we got a different drum machine now we go to channel 3 and then channel 4 so that's just a quick tip on how to change your MIDI channels and how it can work in context in context with working with a device like the iPad and Core Gadget